uh, as I'm driving, I just wanted to, as you can see, I don't normally have my, you know, all my stuff on, my glasses and hat, image. I, I just wanted to take a time out to say, I haven't done RIPs in a while or anything, but we lost a Wyndham Rotunda and um, also Terry Funk. Uh, Terry Funk, I actually met, didn't get an autograph or nothing. I actually he saw him at an event and he was really, really nice, really, really cordial. Um, you know, passed away recently. He was in his 80s. He was always appreciative and he was even uh, really cool when I met him. I was like, oh man, Terry Funk, man, it's really cool to meet you and stuff. He was like, hey, hey, kid, how you doing? He's like, oh yeah, you know, I did that. And I was talking about like, a, uh, I recently watched his uh, Cactus Jack. Um, and when we like changed our Charlie match and stuff, and uh, he was like, "Oh yeah," he was like, "Oh, it was really crazy," and, you know, things like that. And he, he was a pioneer in ECW and everything. He was a legend, and he was really sweet and kind. So I thought that was uh, really uh, cool to meet him. And uh, Wingham Rotunda, you know, also known as Bray Wyatt. I actually, I have to find my imager stuff. I have like pictures with people and they're on these imager site uh, that I still have to pull and I just never did. And because I moved, I packed them away. When I find them, I'll get it. But I have a picture with them um, from that actually, from when I met him. And he was, it was when he was doing a muscle man uh, thing. He was dressed up as his muscle man gimmick went before he went into the fiend, which I love the fiend. Uh, I bought, I think on one of my previous, one of my unlockings, you show, like, I bought the pop figure immediately when it became available on uh, WWE. Like, I loved the Fiend gimmick and the whole thing. So, after I met him, um, he was really kind, really sweet. He was inviting. And there was people who were there, and they actually knew him. Like, like he remembered them. He was like, oh, I saw you here, and, and this stuff like that, which was crazy. Because the girl was like, do you remember me and stuff? So that was wild, right? So about a year or some change or sometime later, uh, WWE was coming to, like, Philadelphia. And I ended up uh, being over in Philadelphia, and I saw him. And I said, oh, man, hey. Uh, he was heading into something. I think he was going with his family. But it was like he was on the move, like... And people were like, you know, trying to take pictures with him and stuff. And I didn't really want to bug him because it looked like he didn't have like a bothered face, but he looked like he was on the move, right? So I mentioned, I said, hey, man, I saw you. And he was like, yeah, you saw me at this, uh, the event some time ago. I, uh, I forgot I had like a hat on or something. It was the same hat. And he was like, was it that? Or was it like over there? And I was like, what? <laughs> he, like, he didn't remember my name, but he like remembered my face. He's like, I, I recognize your face. Uh... You know, uh, the thing, because we talked for a little bit. And it was really cool. I mean, he didn't have to remember me. He could have did not. But he was like, I kind of, like, he was able to kind of place me. And I seen him when he did the thing where it was like a little kid. He was talking to them. And he was just so warm and, and so kind. And he was a genuine talent. And he was a genuine genius. And just like Terry, he did an impact on the business. Like, he's one of the first wrestlers I could think of that did, like, cinematic uh, wrestling matches outside of, like, the Hardys. And he was able to change his character in these amazing ways where he was like the cult leader for Bray Wyatt and the Wyatt family. Then he was like the TV host and he was this. And then he kind of turned into this new Wyatt with, and he was just a master storyteller. And it, it was like he just played on these things and it was so much talent. And he, he really honestly made an impact on the business whether people realize it or not in his tenure. There's a lot of things I noticed that people would love and he could captivate an audience. And, um, you know, with the fireflies and everything. So, hopefully if I find that picture, I'll be able to post it one day. I actually want to post all my pictures. Uh, I only posted some on my Facebook. But, uh, I do have his autograph and uh, stuff like that. So, uh, you know, I cherish it. He's literally, to me, one of my favorite wrestlers of modern day. But I, I'm sorry for the family's loss and uh, both families. And I know he was a father. Uh, Jojo, I got to see her. She was really kind and sweet. His kids are adorable. And um, it's very tragic losses. 
So I just want to send my condolences out. And um, I hope both of you rest in peace. Realize that you impacted mine and millions of other people's lives in multiple ways. Um, Terry Funk, yes, especially Bray Wyatt. Like, one of the best, to me, one of the best gimmicks I've ever seen. I love that guy. Uh, he's right up there with Karrion Cross for me. Who's another guy I just love. So, um... Just want to send my love support. I know I'm not like a nobody, but I'm just a person who, especially both of those guys actually didn't just entertain me, but I got to, the opportunity to meet them and they were, the experiences were amazing. And Bray, you know, especially was like, wow, this dude lived up to how awesome some people can be. So hug your loved ones. Um, I'm not put, putting out as many videos. There's a lot of stuff going on privately in my life, not just with me personally, but with like family and friends, like a lot of rough stuff right now. So that's why my videos have been kind of more sporadic. I'm sorry for that, but yeah, I don't really want to go into it, but let's just say it's not a great time for the Geek Protagonist right now. So uh, I hope you all have a great day. Stay safe, stay healthy, uh, stay as real as you can, and uh, just take care. And take care of your loved ones. Because, uh, yeah, it's, it's a lot. See ya.